Hello and welcome back to Legacy of the Void. You are seeing this cool loading screen because I failed this mission. I was considering showing you the failure, but I literally got to the very end of the mission and just didn't have enough steam to finish off. So that would have been kind of terrible to watch. So let's do it right, shall we? Welcome to Bennett Port, at least what's left of it. Mobius cores entrench themselves here to keep us from the artifact. Valerian's setting up his base now. Once he gets What is happening? The hybrid are channeling void energy into the keystone. The resulting psionic disruption has overwhelmed the Terrans. Deploy our immortals. We need heavy assault to protect these Terrans until the disruption subsides. Man, that's two I owe you, Artemis. Felt like I was losing my damn mind. The keystone is recharging, Commander. It will surely activate it again soon. We must reclaim it. You ain't kidding. Let's lock and load, partner. Alright, so this mission is all about immortals, immortals, immortals. Basically, we have Terran enemies and hybrid enemies, and when that thingy goes off, that disruptor, our Terran enemies are in fact disrupted and can't do anything, but so is the case also with um, our allies. At sieging enemies or defending our allies. So essentially, we just have to protect our buddies while the hybrids right. attack. My boys are taking this fight to Mobius Core. Once you got your defenses in place, bring the heat. And we can also come on, use your words. We can also like attack into the um, enemy bases while they are also disrupted. Kind of like how when everything froze on that fr protest planet. In hard this swarm. disruption has hit my forces hard. We've taken heavy casualties, and we're going to need more time to establish our fortifications. Do what you can to keep them at bay. Okay. Oh, sure. Your position will be secure till they fire up that keystone again. Yep. So essentially, I'm gonna try and get at least three immortals ready to fight them when we get there. But the first few fights are gonna be difficult going until we like really sort of get a good mass of mortals. And even then, like I said, I lost this first mission due to running out of steam, so... It's very important that we take good engagements, fight only when we can, and don't screw up too much. Hierarch, several of our Dominion research facilities are reporting that they are under attack. If you can rescue them, I'll return any Protoss technology they've collected to you. Sounds good, Valerian. I will accept that deal. So I'm just going to build up my base as well as I can until I get 75 energy and then building up the rest of my base is going to be very, very quick. Let's start making this as well because we're going to need gas, gas, gas. Immortals eat gas like nobody's business. So we just need three more of these, well six more, let's do both both geysers, and then I will get one more probe to be my buildy pylon probe, which I feel like is always an important part of being a Protoss. So there we go, we're just about ready for this chrono surge. Go! And there you go, that's that problem solved. We're going to need to build a forge and cannons and like stuff like that because this base will be attacked a little bit, not very much actually, so we're not going to need many cannons, but I think it's important that I get some cannons. So I'm going to try and hold off with just my three immortals for this because I can't really afford to make any more right now. You know, I've got to set things up, I've got to set up shop, got to have a good time. So when that forge is done, I will make my cannons. And I'm also going to put out, put down one of those Kaidaran amulets. Just, uh, just as a nice make sure a doodle. Alright, forge is ready. Let's get some cannons. Nope. The enemy closes indeed. Let's see how you're doing. 
Let's try and get you out of the firing line. There you go. Tank it. Tank it like a Polaroid picture. There we go. I'll just move those back for a bit. Because they will need to recover. Because they can't make it on their own. And... Yeah, I do. Let's just admit... I didn't, make, didn't leave space, so actually I'm not going to worry about it. Where's my buildy probe? I would like a pile on here. Come on. Come on. Alright, the disruption. Okay, I've lost all my guys. Kind of expected to, but... We kept them nice and safe. Now they can start doing stuff. And I'm not going to bother attacking until the next disruption. It's all going to be about building up my forces now. So... Gas. I like how the upgrades spell gas. And if you're wondering why queue them, what's the point of that? It will take ages. Well, no it won't. It will not take ages at all. So let's start building up our immortals again. While we just watch the glory that is these researchers. Look at it go! The speed of it! Oh, but now it's done. So, I don't know. We'll keep those queued anyway, because otherwise I'll just forget. You know what I'm like. Thou knowest what I am like. Right. Let's get some stalkers as well. Just to attack air units. I'm not going to get many stalkers. Honestly, loads of immortals is the key to this. So I'm just going to try and have like three stalkers at any time. I feel like that will really do the job. In the meantime, it's just all about those immortals. Alright, there we go. I should be fine. I planned this out perfectly so that I'd be fine. I need to build another cannon now, for starters. I just can't seem to build that cannon anymore. There we go. And maybe I'll put in a nice battery thing. That'll be... That'll be how we treat ourselves. Right, let's go back now. Because it will soon be time to make another immortal. And once it is... Well then. I do! Three immortals, three stalkers. A force anyone can be proud of. Like I say, we're just going to keep going till the disruption, because then these uh, red Terrans become very easy to defeat as well. Because they stop moving just like the blue Terrans do. And again, it's all about efficiency. I need to make it through because there's loads of like hybrid destroyers around this thing, and they can really just wreck armies apart, so I need, I need to deal with that. Come on. There you go. There's a good boy. Ah, uh, siege tanks are so satisfying, both to use and to kill. I love killing siege tanks as Zerg, especially with mutalisks. Yes, and I believe this time around they'll go and attack Valerian. So I shall be ready for that. Don't you worry. In fact, I will also I like I'll make her pylon at Valerian's base. That'll be a clever thing to do, I think. And if you're worrying about me pooling resources, obviously when I've got a lot, I can just make absolutely loads, loads of immortals using that boost, that boost ability of ours. It'll come in very well for just really pumping out immortals. There we go. That should solve the problem. The perfect micro. You just can't beat it. So now I will I'll fight ahead, kill as many Terrans as I can, as I said I would do. There we go. You can't do anything to us, matey. It's not happening. Just not happening. 
this, on the other hand, is very much happening, so... Right. Now it is time. Come on, wasting time here. There we go. Let's get loads of immortals. Absolutely loads of them. There you go, see? Look at this, instant army. No problem whatsoever. And I need another stalker to keep it up to a nice three. And now I'm going to come back to the base because I want to forge up here. Forge up here and get the last thingy and then I want to come back down and p during a disruption I just want to cut a swath through there and then I should be about ready to finish the mission. But I won't wait for a disruption for this one because there's not actually that much up there and it would be a little bit overkill to wait that long. To wait that long just to forge up there when that time is much better spent elsewhere. Do you understand? Dust thou get it. Good. There we go. Require my skills. Oh, beautiful. Tank fire. Love it. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh. I'm going to need another pylon as well. So. Come on. I'm screwing everything up. There we go. And now let's get you back down here as well. Oh, there's a hybrid. I'm presuming this hybrid would always be hanging out here. Alright, we're going to go up here. There is one flying unit, and that's what the three stalkers are for. Speaking of, better keep my stalkers safe for that very reason. There you go, stalkers can deal with it. Banshee going down. Thank you for your help. Our last science vessels are on their way to the front line. Uh, we can deal with that, right? No? No? No, we can't? Okay. Okay, this uh, could be bad for us, actually. I mean, I guess we're ultimately going to win this. Have I actually lost anything? I don't think I have. So that's... That's something. That is something. So let's just build one more cannon here. And that should really, that should really keep us going. Uh, in fact, I want to just build two more. Fucking hell! I always get my buttons wrong. Two more pylons so that we can really like bring in some immortals. Let's get you to safety, good buddy. Let the Terran do as much fighting as possible, because. Yep. So. There we go. Just get some nice, nice, nice things. And actually, I said I was going to forge downwards, didn't I? I've, uh, I've not made the journey I promised myself I would. So let's go down. So I really want to start carving a path through here, because that will get us to the third bonus, you see. And that ultimately is what I want. Looks like we're still going to make decent time. And I should probably start constructing additional pylons as well, because we're doing a lot better than I thought I would. And there we go, here come the fun! There we go. Alright, now we can start really just having some fun. Or must I? Just too good. Just too good at this game. Alright, and it looks like once those pylons come up we can make loads more immortals as well. And that's what I am after. There we go. And now... And really take out as big a chunk as you can. Like getting that tank, good stuff like that. I 
And now I want to start moving back. Because Valerian can help me. Valerian can help me with this assault. Dominion SCVs, establish a fortification line here. Do it. Just do it. In fact, you know what? A little pylon, come join them. Let's get some forward forward establishments here. Get a few more stalkers as well, just for any sort of air attacks that might be coming. And then it's definitely nothing but nothing but immortals from here on in. Don't forget we can do this! Very important thing to remember, I feel. Alright, I'm gonna move back. Oh shit, because I really don't want to like commit too much. Because that's what killed me last time. I was throwing resources when I didn't have to. We can get that Thor at least. There we go. Get that tank. Yeah. But come on, Valerian, you can spare more than a few marines, can't you? Can't you? Can you not? I mean, sure, I should probably back your marines up, but the point is, you can do more. You can do more. So, move back. Keep making the same mistake. Let's start moving down. Let's go down, da 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 down, da da down. There we go, this, uh, this ain't gonna last long. Does it? Get away, little buddy. Come on. Not much longer, and then we've got all three things, and then next disruption is when I really want to make my final push. Almost everyone died. Just a few medevacs left. I'll send them to support the Emperor's forces. Emperor Valerian, we have secured all of the threatened facilities. I promise you, I won't forget this kindness, Hierarch. Keystone is emitting powerful energies. I expect it will fire again soon. Bam! Bam! Ah, oh, every second counts when you've got this upgrade up going. This boost, this whatever. There we go. I think four is about as well as we can do. Alright. Stalker, stalker, stalker! Let's go. Cut a bloody path. I'm not so worried about that because, um... You know, it's going to take a long time to destroy their command centers with a few hybrids. I feel like we can we can deal, deal some damage long before that becomes a problem. There we go, just stutter step our way through. There's nothing for it, my guys can't really move fast enough to survive that, like, destroyer storm, so I might as well just fight through the pain. That's the sad reality of it. As you can see, with its time, we can really make progress to this base that we couldn't have done before. Come on. Ah, it's annoying that he's like under the thing. We've still got him at least. We can get there. 30 seconds more. 30 seconds more. I think we can do this. A bit more stutter stepping. That's getting hairy. Because those storms are just so deadly. Oh, fuck! I can't. I, uh, I thought, you know what, I'll just leave Rainer to get on with it. But no, don't leave Rainer to get on with it. I don't know where the last checkpoint was, but I sure hope it wasn't too far away ago. 
Uh, everyone watching this video was probably like watching that as well. Almost everyone died. Okay. Just a few medevacs left. I'll send them to support the Emperor's forces. Emperor Valeri, we have secured all of the threatened facilities. I promise you, I won't forget this kindness, Hierarch. Keystone is emitting powerful energies. I expect it will fire again soon. I expect it will as well, so... Let's just get as much as we can. And this time we'll intercept. Intercept. Go, go, go. Gotta, gotta get him. Gotta get him. Come on! Come on! Alright, and this time I'm not going to bother stutter stepping. I'm just going to like really try and get this done in one. One fell blow. Alright, I'm going to wait for them to come down to us. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You never know if this reinforcements will make it in time. Let's go. Yeah, we can. But we're running low on time. These destroyers gotta go! There we go. Come on. Time is really running short now. Okay. Okay. That is, uh. That is not the one where we try to end it. We're gonna have to wait for the disruption after this because I just don't have the chops. I just don't have the chops to do it. So, yeah, I think we use this disruption really clearing out that base and, uh, letting, you know, Rainer and Valerian take over. Say, oh, come on, come on. Really? Alright, load. Brothers in arms. Phew. Come on. We have to go back a little bit, because that can't be the save where we do it. Because that is the screw up save. That is the screw up save, and we're not we're not starting this whole mission again. We don't have to. There we go. Everyone died. Thank you. Just a few medevacs left. I'll send them to support the Emperor's forces. Emperor Valerian, we have secured all of the threatened facilities. I promise you, I won't forget this kindness, Hierarch. The Keystone is reaching full power, Hierarch. We will need to defend our allies from the hybrid once more. Bam! Come on! Alright, so, yep, we're just going to clear it out this time. That's all we're doing. And a good old spring cleaning of red terran there you go so let's go intercept them and then we'll just kill everything around them that is my plan that is the plan I have cooked up for all of us let's just hope we can actually make it there in time to intercept there we go Kill them destroyers. They're not destroyers. It's the biggins that are destroyers, but kill them anyway. And now, just have a good time. Get killing. There we go. Just clean it all up. Come with the biggest forces possible. There's a destroyer. It's got to go. It's got to get out of here. There we go.
That's good. That's good. We can move forward. We can have a good time. Let's start cutting a bloody path through everything. And the next disruption will be the one. There we go. Just don't worry, my Terran friends. Let's get one here. Let's get a nice, lovely one up here. Didn't mean to make zealots. I think my probe just died. Okay, well, you know. There we go. Not a problem for my forces right now, though. So you, did probe. Let's get you here instead. So, as always, I don't want to commit too many resources to pushing against. I don't want to commit too many resources. I really don't. It's just a bad idea. It's a bad idea. There we go. Come on. Get out of there, friends. Get out of there. Might as well build one more probe to replace the one that's gone. Okay, come on. Rainer, Valerian, we really have to work on this together. We cannot let them push us back. That's unacceptable to me. Haha! <laughs> Stalkers, get him! There we go. Oh shit! That Yamato cannon. Did I ever get that pylon made or did that other probe die as well? That's just kind of annoying, isn't it? Alright, let's uh... Come on, we've got to make some headway here. Otherwise, we're never going to get anywhere. Or maybe we should just focus on like building up an army. Just build it up. Mineral feels depleted though, so I'm really running low on time. Got to bear in mind I can use orbital strikes. That is a thing. That is a thing. Mm. It burns. You know what? I'm going to build two. Right, we've got to save it. We've got to save it and see if we can do this. Yes, you do. Go! Go, go, go! Gotta do intercept. Gotta do some intercepts. There we go. You know what? Maybe I don't go for it this time. Maybe I wait one more time. Maybe that's what I do. Here comes the destroyer. There we go. Destroyer's out of here. We must press on until. We must press on. Let's see if we can do it. Let's see if we can do it. The auto strike is not as strong as you'd think against them, is it? My time is running low.
One army. Okay. 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 Uh, there we go. Let's um. Let's uh understand our limits here. We need one more push, definitely. One more push, and I'm just really gonna hang back and get as big an army as I can. I think that's that's all I can do. So let us let's go back here. No, let's go back up here. This is where I want to be. And my last chunk of minerals and last chunk of whatever is where we're going. That is where we are going. So let us just make the absolute most of this. Don't worry, Raina, we will. I've probably done this embarrassingly slowly, but. Don't even care. Shit. Come on. Alright, so now we really are just sticking back and building up. Sticking back and building up, because I don't feel like we can really make any progress, even with Raina's Raiders here. It's just like an endless tug of war, and I lose too much trying to do it. That's what I've found. That is the uh, conclusion I have drawn. Probably do another one as well. There we go. Because immortals are beefy, beefy units. They take up four supply. So it's actually only two pylons to uh, that one pylon for two immortals. It's not a lot. It's not a lot. Yeah, Vespian guys are exhausted. This next disruption is definitely going to have to be the last. Alright, come on, Reyna. Uh, or Valerian, whichever one you are. Sort your shit out. Because I can't afford to lose my pylons. I really can't. I just can't do it. I just can't do it. So, Chrono Surge. Bam. Oh, there we go. There we go. I mean, come on. Are you? Am I gonna like fail the mission because you guys are gonna screw up? You're gonna get killed by this little Terran force. This little baby Terran force. I was given to understand I need to protect you against hybrid. Not fucking Mobius. <sighs> this next is definitely gonna be the last one. It just has to be. I mean, we look at the evidence. We look at the evidence around us, and we understand that this cannot continue. You just survive for another thirty seconds, and then I'll finish the job. Yep, 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 yep. <sighs> Alright, let's save it. Let's do it. Let's get a save on the go. Save that game. In ten seconds time, the fun begins. This is when the fun begins, Anakin. Anakin! For what good this will do? The destroyer's got to go first. He is the biggest threat to us. And now you, you, there we go. It's going well. Going well for now. Whatever that building was, fuck it. It's gone now. I was attempting to blink micro all fancy like, but it didn't really work, did it? Boop. It doesn't work. Alright, it looks like I'm at least going to win this time. I can feel a win coming on. There we go. Problem absolutely solved. 
it now almost seems anticlimactic how much I had left at the end of that, but we saw what happened. We saw what happened when I tried to push it. It just didn't work. Hi, Balon. Alright, so what do we do? Let me guess. No achievements at all. Ooh, cutscene. Kiss. Did you know this warrior? story. I know all their stories. None of them ever think it'll end like this. Reports been coming in from all over. Dominion worlds overrun. Outposts destroyed. A lot more dead boys out there. Warriors. Death is the fate of all warriors. A fate we too may soon embrace. Fate ain't written, Artanis. Way I see it, if Zeratul believed you could make a difference in all this, then this fight's just begun. It is your custom to shake the hand of a friend. Is it not? Give him hell, Artanis. Well, you know, at least their planet didn't blow up. Small favours. So, <gasps> we got all the achievements, but we did so badly. Let's see, complete it. Destroy 80 more enemies affected by destruction. Sure. Uh, do not let your allies leave more than five base blockers. Did it. Solved. Sorted. So is that as done with Korhal? I assume it is. We are going to another planet. Two missions per planet is a decent amount, I suppose. Bring nothing but death. Sacred purpose 
An end to a cycle not within the actual sin. Your resistance will only bring unneeded suffering. Connection to the Kala, then you will be contained, kept in stasis. I will preserve the Kala however I must. If I must endure imprisonment, so be it. I don't feel like we're very good friends with her. There's friction there. Spear of a Dune, Solar Core. What's going on, Beardy? Carax. I'll just call you Mr. Beards. What's going down? Look here, Hierarch. This material self-regenerates. It is no wonder the research of the Terrans claimed it to be from a recent epoch. My projections place it at several billion years old, if not more. Zeratul's vision said that this keystone can guide us unto hope. What do you think it means? Yes, guide us. It is a code wanting to be cracked. The keystone seems to be able to manipulate energies, but that may not be its sole purpose. I believe it stores its origin point within. Its origin point? Yes, I promise you. I will find out how this will lead us to the Zelnaga. Redouble your efforts, Karax. There is little time. Cool. Let's spend our solarite, have a bit of fun. So we've only got 15, we can't do that much. Did I? Well, I liked Warp Harmonization for that mission, it did a lot for me. So I'll keep it for now. Let's just uh, go for. Um, it's only structures, though. Shame it can't do units as well. I know, I know, I know. I'm greedy. So let's check out the War Council. You're imprisoned, you don't like us, that's fine. Cool, what do we got? I to serve. Uh, creates barrier that absorbs lots amounts of incoming damage, deals bonus damage to armed units, so that's like normal? That just feels normal to me. Uh... Shadow Cannon deals heavy damage, deals. Oh, and it can deal damage to air units. Immortals that can hit air spells good news to me. Though if they lose their shields, then they're not really immortals. Uh... I return to serve. We'll give them a try. We'll give them a try, but I, I, I think it just, just ruins the point. Makes them expensive stalkers. But maybe I'm wrong, what do I know? So yeah, warp travel is ready, we're done with Korhal. Uh, so let's see what Vorazan has to say to us. Amon's reach extends further than I ever imagined. This war has only begun. It is one that will test our every limit. Zeratul believed that the Zelnaga lived, and that they would aid us. I have heard his prophecies as well. It is said that the Zelnaga come from a world that exists where none should. From there, all life in our universe takes its root. Our forebearers searched for it, but nothing beyond legend was ever found. And you? Do you believe as Zeratul did? Zeratul killed my mother, Artanis. I will always hate him for this. I will always hold him in the highest contempt. Raja Gaul was corrupted by the Queen of Blades, Matriarch. Yes, I know that now. Reason has no bearing on emotion. Our kind embraces this more than yours. Zeratul grieved for her as well, 
His sense of guilt drove him to uncover the ancient prophecies, to find hope for our people. You will forgive me if I do not place my faith in the words of an exile. Be nice to Zeratul. He was our favorite and he's dead. Alright, let's see what Reyna has to say one last time. Uh, hey there, your royal Ness. Rory. Man, this is weird. I've never talked to no Protoss before. <laughs> hey. If I have learned one thing from your commander, Raynor, it is that we are not so different, Rory Swan. Continue your report. Right. So, the artifact, uh, the, uh, the keystone thingy's all yours. We're in the middle of transmitting all our data to your engineer. You have my thanks. Please relay my appreciation to Commander Raynor. Hey, you got it, Skippy. Skippy? Skippy. So now that that's all done, I'm going to say goodbye for today. I will get more videos out tomorrow, or more likely later today, because I've in fact been recording until late in the night. What can I say? I've just been having too much fun with my new snowball, which hopefully is doing the trick for you. I mean, I am like an obsessive perfectionist, so the fact that you can hear the fan is going to screw me up, but I, I know that you're not even going to hear it, except for like very quiet moments of the video. That's the only time it's ever going to be a problem for you guys. Um, and, you know, that's... That's just the way things are. My fan is near my mic. There's nothing I can really do about that. Uh, though now that I'm about to end the video, perhaps I will risk showing you it. Here it is, my lovely snowball. Don't be blinded by the light. It's very, very bright. God knows what that all just did to my voice, me lifting it like that. But hopefully you just had a good time. So thank you very much for watching this, and I will see you later.